Good Monday afternoon, Western Montana. I'm Kate Hockey, and this is the 406, the Missoulians' weekday webcast. Here are the top headlines at this hour. The Missoula Police Department has released surveillance photos of a suspect who robbed a convenience store at gunpoint early Saturday morning. Police say the man entered South Avenue Market, pointed a gun at the clerk, and demanded cash from the register. The suspect was wearing a multicolored striped hooded sweatshirt, blue jeans, and tennis shoes. He covered his face with a black handkerchief. The clerk complied with the robber's demands and was not harmed in the incident. Patients seeking care through the Fort Harrison Veterans Affairs Medical Center outside Helena are waiting an average of 48 days for their first appointment with a primary care physician, more than three times longer than the department's goal of 14 days. The VA now says that meeting the, that target was unattainable, giving in existing resources and growing demand. The Montana findings released today are part of a national audit ordered after a whistleblower claimed veterans were dying while waiting for care in Phoenix. A homeless man was attacked in downtown Missoula over the weekend and woke from the beating to find his wheelchair had been taken. Missoula Police Spokesman Travis Welsh said today that a homeless male reported being assaulted and robbed by two men while he was sleeping in an alley in the 400 block of North Higgins Avenue. The victim could not identify his attackers other than one was Hispanic and one was white. Missoula police are investigating a rape that occurred early Friday morning in a home on Mount Avenue. Missoula police spokesman Travis Welsh said the woman reported the attack on Saturday around 5.45 p.m. He said the 34-year-old man and the 36-year-old woman were acquainted and the two were visiting when the attack occurred in a residence. The Montana Newspaper Association will sponsor the first U.S. Senate and House candidate debates of the general election season. The debates will be held in the Library Auditorium at Montana Tech in Butte on Saturday afternoon. The U.S. Senate debate will begin at 1.30 p.m., followed by the U.S. House debate at 3.30 p.m. We'll have live streaming coverage on Missoulian.com. Have a great evening, Western Montana. Check back with us on Missoulian.com for updates and breaking news. And pick up a copy of Tuesday morning's print edition of the Missoulian for the most complete local news coverage in Western Montana. I'm Kate Hockey, and that's the 406 for Monday, June 9th, 2014, brought to you by The Green Light.